Hello everyone. Today we shall look into all selected function. All selected function removes context filters from columns and rows in the current query. It retains all the context filters or explicit filters which are applied on the table or visual. This function it can be used to obtain visual totals in queries. If there is one argument, the argument is either table name or column name. If there is more than one argument, they must be columns from the same table. This function is different from all function because it retains all fun all filters explicitly set within the query and retains all context filters other than row and column filters. This function is not supported for use in direct query mode when it is used in calculated columns or row level security rules. Let us see an example. Here we have an example that for every brand which we have we have the total sales measure total sales measure is sum of sales and we have written the all sales uh, measure where i could where you could see that i am calculating total sales uh, and the filter condition is all sales so by using all sales we have uh, we could see that the total is like 127 million through which we have calculated the percentage sales let us see all selected sales and see how it works i'll create a new measure i'll uh, write the name all selected sales calculate in the first parameter i'll i'll provide total sales measure which is my sum of sales in the filter condition instead of all i'll write all selected in the table name i'll write sales table okay i'll close the parenthesis close the parenthesis and hit enter i'll bring it into the table here you could see that since since all selected and all sales both uh, removes all the filters which are existing you could see no difference here okay i'll create a percentage sales measure for all selected and uh, we could notice the difference as soon as we create and apply the filters i'll write percentage all selected sales equal to divide total sales comma all selected sales i'll close the parenthesis hit enter i'll bring this measure into the table here you could see that my percentages are also uh, same similar to the all cell percentage sales the difference between all and all filters here we could see when i whenever i select the brand here you could see that for that particular brand whichever is selected it is representing the all selected sales whereas all sales is removing all the filters and showing me the total sales suppose that if i control and select uh, these three brands for whatever it is selected it is showing me the to total sales is uh, returning me the total sales which is 71 million all sales is remo removing all the filters and uh, returning me 127 million okay all selected sales for whatever i have selected it will return me the total this is how all selected sales work like whatever it is selected it will apply filter to the respective uh, you know category and then it removes all the other filters i hope it is understandable here i'll give another example where we can apply the column names instead of uh, table name okay i'll create another measure which is all selected uh, you know column sales where where we could use columns i'll write all selected to equal to calculate we can we can calculate the total sales now in all selected function instead of writing table name i'll write column names which are brand and country i'll close the parenthesis and hit enter i'll create one more measure for all selected to sales which is where i am entering the Uh, columns in the all selected function and i will show you the difference how 
how it is impacted by the external filters here i'll write percentage all selected to equal to divide total sales comma all selected to i'll close the parenthesis hit enter i'll bring in both the measures into the table and uh, show you how it works here i have i am selecting all selected to and percentage all selected to i am selecting the all selected to measure and changing it to percentage okay now all sales and all selected to sales are uh, representing the same uh, if i select brand and country here you could see that whatever the brand and country i have selected total sales is representing the 1 million value whereas all sales it is representing total sales which is 127 million and all selected sales it is similar to the total sales because we have selected those particular filters okay if i uh, and the composition in all selected it is 100% whereas all sales since it is removing all filters the composition is 0.82% according to the brand and country if i add additional country or brand filters it will uh, return us the selected values and its total and all selected will uh, return us the total which is equal to the total sales for the selected values it will return us the total sales that is how all selected works and re it removes all other filters the composition would be 100% this is all uh, for now i hope you have understood how all selected function is working please practice thank you for watching and we shall meet in the next video